friends let's see the application with arduino uh, in previous session we discussed about the basic led as the same led concept you, you are trying to design a traffic signal application so on three different color leds so let's open your arduino ide so this arduino ide uh, uh, the sections are common even for setup and loop so now if you are taking for applications your your applications are not available directly so you need to go for some configurations like so this is my uh, basic led output you, you just saw in the previous session now i am take going to take new sketch so anyway your new sketch have uh, only this setup and loop part so you need to declare in the uh, top of the setup so this is for declaration so whatever your red led so the traffic signal application how you are trying to imagine so there are three colors the three colors which is red yellow and green so according to that my declarations are there yellow led which is connected across pin number 3 and the last led which is green color which is connected across pin number 4 so this is my declaration I am taking for three different color LEDs so this is for red signal and next declaration for yellow signal and next declaration for green signal So these three are three different color LEDs but anyway in setup you need to configure either input or output so that configuration you need to do with the help of pin mode. So pin mode is a macro function which helps to configure your pins either input or output. So this is the pin mode function you can take it. So pin mode is a macro 4 red LED. I am trying to configure as output. And this, the other two colors are also configured as output. So these are three different color LEDs which are configured as the output. And now, so in the loop, you need to write down your own logic. So according to a traffic signal operation, so how you are expecting the display from your three different color LEDs. So the first red color is on, other two colors goes off. So to keep your red signal on, so you need to write logic high for the specific pin. So using this digital write macro, you can keep your red signal high. So this is our LED is high but what about the other two colors you need to keep it off so off means you need to assign logic 0 for that so use the same macro for other two functions so your yellow LED so it should be off so off means you need to assign logic 0 for this and even for green signal also you have to keep it logic low so these two colors you are trying to make it keep it off but you need to wait some time to see the response from three colors so waiting you need to write delay in between operations so i'm just keeping five seconds red signal on and after 5 seconds what is the change you are expecting from your traffic signal so you need to keep it red signal off and yellow signal on so just change their logics according to your operation so I am trying to change my red signal logic low and yellow signal logic high
so after delay but your yellow signal generally operated with very less time delay so your delay should be very small whenever you are handling yellow signals so i'm just changing this delay to only 2 seconds so i'm just keeping yellow signal high up to 2 seconds and after 2 seconds what is the reaction you are expecting so keep yellow signal off and green signal high so i'm just changing my yellow logic to low and keeping green signal high but your green signal is also operated with very high time delay so making green signal also 5 seconds on so after 5 seconds again you have to go for turn off your green signal and moving from green to red you need to manage your yellow in between again so again keep your green signal low and yellow signal high but yellow signal again operated with very less time delay which is 2 seconds so again you will go back to red signal high and yellow signal low and green signal low and to compile this program your board selection is compulsory so you are working with arduino eno or nano whatever it is just compile this program so once your com program don't have any errors and warnings you will get the memory usage now you need to copy this hex file path from the bottom of the program So this X file you need to use for simulate your output. Let's wait. So just copy that path and open your simulation tool so in the simulation tool you can go for controller as well the traffic signal so these three different colors which are you can animate so the three different colors which are available as single package in the simulation now place your controller and place your traffic lights and according to your declaration so where you are connecting your red signal across pin number 2 yellow signal across pin number 3 so that you need to follow for the connection so the second pin which is connected with the red signal and yellow signal is connected with pin number 3 and green signal is connected with pin number 4 now so double click on controller you can paste your hex file path here and click on ok now you can simulate your output so you can watch the response from three signals the red signal which is holding 5 seconds on and moving to yellow signal which is staying 2 seconds and then green signal is high it will wait up to 5 seconds and after 5 seconds it will go back to red signal just by following 2 seconds time delay so this is how you can simulate your applications so in the same LED concept take the LED example from Arduino Uno and edit your connections according to your traffic signal application even you can go for junction also so for junction you need 12 IOs and you need to connect 3 3 pins across 3 3 pins for one signal so this is how you can design complete traffic signal application by using Arduino thanks thanks for watching